Okay, guys, so the latest version of Quen has just dropped. This is Quen 235B A22B. So if you ever want to see new models, open router.ai, click on models, sort by newest. We can actually see all of the new Quen models right here. Now, obviously, we're going to be testing out the big one just because, you know, we're not here to mess around. We want to know whether this can actually code or not. I'm not going to be doing stupid things like how many R's there are in Strawberry or asking it to make a to-do app. Instead, what I'm going to be doing is asking it to create an entire service-based website like the one on your screen right now. And I have an entire SOP for this. Now, if you want a little bit more help with this kind of stuff, or if you just want all my prompts, etc., all in the same place in a nice organized format with table of contents and everything, definitely check out the school. It'll be the first link in the description of this video. And basically, we're going to be using this prompt right here to create a service-based website. Now, I've done this a lot of times, so I am going to be going fairly quickly because I just want to see whether this model is good or not. So we'll go to open router here. We'll see if they've added it. Looks like we can just write this. So Quen, um, what is this, Quen 3? Yeah, let's just copy this. There we go. We won't use the free one. Doesn't support images, interesting. Kind of trash then, isn't it? Okay, so let's see if this the hype is actually worth it or whether it's gonna be another letdown. One thing I will, I will promise you is by the end of this video, you'll have knowledge of whether this model is worth your time or not. Let's just see. So the first thing we do is we make the application. So we'll call this Quen uh, Rolls Royce, right? We'll press enter here. Press enter, 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 enter. And then we'll search for Rolls Royce on my computer, right click, open file location, double click, copy the public folder, right? This just has images inside it. There's nothing special. When this is done, we'll go to file and then open folder and then press Q, select, paste the public folder here. And that is the SOP already set up. This just has images in, like I said. So we'll go to Klein here. I use Klein for this just because um, I want to test it always with the same thing, right? I'm just going to delete my custom instructions because they're not relevant to this exercise. I'm going to save the custom instructions in case I lose them forever. And then we will just dump this prompt in here and we'll see how this does. This is with no, oh, wait, it needs to be on. This is with no um, MCPs or anything. Right, so, oops, that's Gemini. Let's change this to open router. Okay, it's on Quen, there we go. I will be able to tell you within three minutes whether this model is worth your time or not. Let's see how it does with this prompt. Okay, so I'm just gonna say, uh, use placeholder details for contact details. Translate yourself. Do the color scheme, etc. yourself. Everything else, do yourself. Okay, so the thinking tokens are pretty quick here. It's actually, it's relatively quick, I would say. For an open source model, connected to open router is definitely up there. Okay, I mean, this looks fine. This looks pretty good. Okay. Uses Playfair, which is exactly the same as Claude Sonnet. Okay, can it code? Let's find out. Wait, I mean, if these benchmarks are real, this is this is absolutely insane. There's no way those benchmarks are real. I, I will say I really, really take benchmarks with a grain of salt. However, I mean, this is crazy. 32 bill beats 0103 mini. An almost Gemini. Nah. Like, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. This is all hype. There's no way that's true. There's no way that's true. That is insane. I mean, this is actually crazy. Like this comment here. There was a time when I wished that we could run anything close to state of the art on our personal computers. But when 3.4 bill looks like with 3.3 bill, it looks like you can do that now. 
You can run close to a state-of-the-art model locally on any device. That's crazy. I don't, I don't believe this. I, I do not believe this. I, I have to see this for myself. I, like I said, I take benchmarks with a grain of salt. I, I'm, not, I'm not believing this until I see it. I'm really not. I refuse. Okay, so eventually we did get something that looks a little bit like this. Now, everything is 404 ing There are a lot of issues here. But to have a free model that can get to this point is definitely a huge improvement. Now, the next thing that I need to test for you guys is to see, or and also for myself, is to see whether Boomerang Tasks or Orchestrate can now code with Quen basically for free, right? Because this is the lowest of the low in terms of getting um, code from a model, right? It's just using Klein. What I'm now going to test, not now in this video, but next video, I'm going, to I'm going to test this model with Orchestrator. I'm going to leave, leave the video there, guys. This is a pretty good model. I definitely think with Orchestrate, there's a chance that it might actually be as good as Gemini 2.5 Pro. I will test that with MCPs and Orchestrate in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Check out the school. If you're watching all the way to the end of the video, you're an absolute legend. I'll see you very soon with some more content. Peace out.